So this is a six bed stroke unit. This is the occupational therapist in the rehabilitation team working with a child. So this is a patient being managed by a physiotherapist for um, ulnar nerve palsies, um, making a splint for him. Julia, my role in the rehab team is to and sensitize patients on the various conditions that we see. And the main challenge is getting educational materials on those specific uh, conditions to show to patients so that they'll be able to adhere to management and treatment as well. So this is a 49 year old patient who had fractures in both arms, both humerus, and she had a shoulder subluxation of the right arm with the right shoulder. She had a right shoulder subluxation and unfortunately her blood pressures were not being checked. So when I saw her as a rehabilitation physician, I noticed that her blood pressure was very high and we started her on antihypertensives and we've also um, she's being managed also by the dietitian and it's really going well on review today. Hello, my name is Dr. Abna Tano. I'm a family physician specialist with training in rehabilitation medicine also. And um, I have started the first locally led multidisciplinary rehabilitation medicine service in Ghana and I think also in West Africa or Sub-Saharan Africa. Um, disability is stigmatized in Ghana and we didn't have any multidisciplinary rehabilitation service. The only form of rehabilitation we had was physiotherapy previously. So when I saw the need to provide comprehensive care for the patient so that they we maximize their function and also improve their quality of life, then I decided to form the multidisciplinary rehabilitation team with support from management of the hospital. Um, so far, we've been able to improve the quality of life of patients with disabilities who present to Kompanochi Teaching Hospital, which actually also has the nation's biggest trauma or accident and emergency service. 
unfortunately we also have challenges in terms of having equipment and also um, trained staff to form the rehabilitation service, the multidisciplinary service. We are trying to get more trained staff. We need speech and language therapists. We need more occupational therapists. Currently we have only one. Um, so currently we have only one occupational therapist in our, in our team and also in the hospital, but we don't have any speech and language therapists. Um, one other challenge we are also facing is um, some form of opposition from the physiotherapist because they felt threatened that a doctor coming into the team was coming to replace them. But that is not the case and we've gotten some of the physiotherapists to work with us in the multidisciplinary team. We are also having a rehabilitation nurse. We are um, setting up training for, we've already set up training for rehabilitation nurses to also serve in the multidisciplinary rehabilitation service. And we have a health educator, a public health educator who also handles the education and some of the cases for us. Thank you.